Hello, I'm Dr. Michael Beria, and I'm a sports medicine physician in Columbus, Ohio, and I'm excited to walk you through the ACP Max system. ACP Max is an expansion of the tried and true ACP system, allowing us to process a larger volume, concentrating a higher number of platelets while still producing a neutrophil reduced PRP. The ACP Max system maximizes platelet concentration by using a dual spin process, accessing the Buffy coat in the second spin. The ACP Max system has two sterile package trays. The first tray contains the ACP Max and ACP devices and two syringes for PPP extraction. The second tray contains all the necessary components for a blood draw. You have the option of drawing 30, 60, or 90 mLs. In this demonstration, we will be using 60 mLs of blood with anticoagulant. The volume of anticoagulant is dependent on the volume of blood drawn in a one to seven ratio. With the blood draw completed, we'll remove the ACB Max syringe from the tray. We'll prime the syringe by expressing air out of the system, and then cap the syringe with the red cap in the tray. The blood can be introduced from the top of the valve or the bottom using a female-to-female -female connector. We'll remove the syringe guide and then slowly begin filling the ACP Max system with our blood. The ACP Max system uses a dual spin process, and in the first spin, we'll centrifuge ACP Max syringe at 3200 RPMs. The time on the first spin is variable depending on the volume. For the 60 ml volume, we'll spin for six minutes. We've prepared an appropriately measured counterweight. At this stage, we'll place the ACP Max syringe and the counterweight across from each other and spin. In this first spin, we're separating out the platelet pore plasma and creating a buffy coat layer. The platelet pore plasma rises to the top of the density gradient, while the buffy coat is concentrated between the plasma and red blood cell layers. At this point, we're ready to remove the PPP layer and extract the buffy coat. We'll thread our syringe guide back on. and withdraw the PPP layer, stopping two lines short of the red blood cell layer. Next, we'll attach the ACP syringe included in the kit and fill the syringe completely to 15 mLs. The syringe will then be capped and gently inverted to mix the solution. Now we'll spin for 1500 RPMs for five minutes. This is consistent regardless of the initial blood draw volume. By stopping two tick marks short of the RBC layer, we ensure that we don't pull the Buffy coat with the PPP draw. When we attach the ACP syringe, we draw the entire Buffy coat layer, allowing us to resuspend the platelets in this second spin. We'll carefully place this on a flat surface and then use the internal syringe to pull the PRP. stopping short of the RBC layer. Through this process, the ACP Max system can deliver a highly concentrated PRP up to 12 times over baseline platelet concentration, devoid of neutrophils.